Hey guys, I'm Nick, and on this episode of The Scram Line, I'm doing another Gaga inspired cupcake. You guys know that I'm obsessed with Beyonce and Lady Gaga, and Nicki Minaj and Rihanna, and a whole bunch of other people, but I wanted to make another uh, Gaga cupcake. Now, as usual, most of my ideas come while I'm either at the gym or I'm in the shower where I'm disconnected from technology and my mind can just think freely. Most of the time I'm listening to music and most of the time that's Gaga or Beyonce. So these are inspired by one of Gaga's songs, Marry the Night. Uh, I thought, Marry the Night, black. I want them to be really black and sexy and beautiful. Now, I have made black cupcakes and macarons before. Uh, and I use black food dye in those, but in this one, I'm going to be using activated charcoal. So it's a little bit more of a natural food coloring. I hope you guys enjoy watching these. These are the ingredients you need to make them. Okay guys, so start off by preheating your oven to 160 degrees Celsius or 320 degrees Fahrenheit. The ingredients you're going to need are cocoa powder, flour, sugar, softened butter, salt, bicarb soda, milk, eggs, some anise seed which is going to give us that licorice flavour and that is completely optional and over here I've got my activated charcoal. Now you can grab this from any health food store or online. Now guys if you're watching this and you haven't subscribed make sure you hit that subscribe button. We're going to start off by popping all of our dry ingredients into a large mixing bowl. Mix that on low speed until everything is well combined and you can see it's made everything black already. We're going to add our softened butter in there and mix it until it's well combined. Now while that's mixing, we're going to add our milk and eggs to a large jug. We're going to whisk those up. Then we're going to add our wet ingredients to our dry ingredients in a slow and steady stream. Once it's all in there, you want to stop your mixer and scrape down the bowl just to get those bits at the bottom that might not be mixed in properly. And then mix for a final 20 seconds. We're going to scoop our butter into our cupcake liners, filling them up about three quarters of the way. We're going to bake these for about 25 to 30 minutes. Then you want to transfer them to a cooling rack. Now while those are baking, we're going to add some activated charcoal to our buttercream frosting. So I'm using my chocolate buttercream frosting. You can find the recipe for that on my website. I'm using a Wilton 1M tip to frost these cupcakes in a swirl. And guys, that is pretty much it. Now, how sexy are these cupcakes? Perfect for Halloween when it's coming up in October. Perfect for any goth event. Pretty much perfect for anything. These things are gorgeous. Okay, guys, so those were my Marry the Night cupcakes. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you did, hit the like button. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. You'll find the recipe on my website, thescranline.com. Link for that is in the box below. Thanks so much for watching. Just a quick reminder, I'm doing a meetup in LA on the 27th of June. If you want to come along, it's going to be in Santa Monica. All of the details are on my website. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I'll see you all on the next episode of The Scramline.